If you recently bought a second-hand iPhone and got a device stuck on the activation lock screen, forgot your iCloud password, or the phone had to be reset and now asks for iCloud login, and you simply don't have access to the previous owner's Apple ID, this guide will help you change the device status to activation lock to owner so you can finish setup normally. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to remove iPhone iCloud activation lock to owner on any iPhone model. To unlock your iPhone and remove the iCloud activation lock, you will need to use Dr. Phone. Dr. Phone recently introduced a new feature specifically designed for this problem, Unlock All iOS iCloud Activation Lock, which supports every iPhone model from iPhone XR up to iPhone 17 Pro Max, and even iPad. With Dr. Phone, you can easily remove the iCloud activation lock screen, sign in using your own Apple ID fully activate the device, and use all features normally without restrictions. The best part is that the process requires no jailbreak. The steps are simple, and it works on the latest iOS versions. Dr. Phone supports both Windows and Mac, making it accessible for everyone. So if you want to unlock your iPhone's activation lock safely and successfully, Dr. Phone is the tool you need. Now let's put Dr. Phone to the test and unlock our device. First, download and install Dr. Phone on your computer. It works on both Windows and Mac, so just choose the version that matches your system. Once installed, open the program and get ready, we're going to begin the unlocking process. Next, plug your iPhone into the computer using a USB cable. Once Dr. Phone is open, go to the main screen and select Toolbox, then look for the option called Screen Unlock. Inside this menu, you'll see several unlocking features available, including Unlock iOS Screen, Remove Activation Lock, Remove Apple ID, and more. Dr. Phone provides multiple ways to unlock your device depending on your situation. If your iPhone fully supports the Remove Activation Lock method, select that option to start turning your device into Activation Lock to owner status. But if your device isn't eligible for activation lock removal, or if the phone has not been factory reset yet, you can use the unlock iOS screen method instead. This helps access the device first, before applying a deeper unlock later. In short, Dr. Phone gives you different unlocking paths based on your model and lock status, so just pick the option that best matches your device condition and continue. In my case, my iPhone doesn't support the direct activation lock removal method, so I'm going to unlock it using iOS screen unlock. To continue, Dr. Phone will ask you to put your device into DFU mode. Just follow the on-screen instructions carefully. The steps are different depending on your iPhone model, but Dr. Phone will guide you through the buttons to press and for how long. Once your device successfully enters DFU mode, Dr. Phone will begin reading your system information and prepare to download the correct firmware package. Before the unlock process can continue, you need to download the firmware first. This firmware will be used to reinstall the iOS system on your iPhone, ensuring the device can be unlocked safely and properly. Just wait for the download to finish, and once the firmware is ready, Dr. Phone will proceed with the installation and continue the unlock process automatically. The following screen displays the progress of the iOS firmware that is being downloaded on the platform. After the iOS firmware is downloaded successfully, it is verified and displayed on the next screen. Continue to select the Unlock Now button to execute the unlocking process. A prompt window appears on the screen, asking for confirmation of the process. Type in the required code and tap Unlock to proceed with the final result. The next screen shows the progress bar of the unlocking iOS device. Keep in mind that the device should remain connected which, if neglected, will brick it. As the iDevice is unlocked successfully, click the Done button to conclude the process. If you are still left with a locked eye device, click try again to restart the process. Once the unlock process is complete, go back to your iPhone. Your device should restart and display the hello screen just like when setting up a brand new iPhone. Follow the on-screen setup steps, choose your language region, connect to Wi-Fi, and then sign in using your own Apple ID. You can also create a new Apple ID if needed. If you previously had a backup, you can restore it from iCloud, iTunes, or even transfer data from another device during setup. After everything finishes, you'll arrive at the home screen, and your iPhone will be ready to use normally. And that's how you remove the activation lock and bring your iPhone back to life. Once the process finishes, you'll be able to sign in with your own Apple ID use all features normally and set up the device just like new. If you want to try Dr. Phone yourself, I've included the download link and useful resources in the video description, 
so feel free to check those out. Follow the steps carefully, and if you run into any issues, or have questions about your device model, iOS version, or unlock options drop a comment below. I always do my best to help. Thanks so much for watching, stay safe, and I'll see you again in the next video.